Eight more sodium chloride. And I'm just writing this down. To 300 milliliters. And this is a dilution problem. And for dilution, the formula is M1V1 equals M2V2. And the dilution formula is on your conversion and equation sheets. Uh, it's, hmm, it's on your uh, conversion and equation sheets a little differently. It says C1V1 equals C2V2. Where the C1 is the concentration of solution one. which tends to be the more concentrated one. And M, capital M here, specifically means one unit of concentration, which is uh, molarity. So uh, C1V1 equals C2V2 is the more general case. M1V1 equals M2V2 is the more specific case. And since almost everything we do in this course deals with molarity, uh, this is a fine one. Now, uh, I'm starting with 10 milliliters of 0 0.8 molar sodium chloride. Of, in math and chemistry, means multiply by, and we will be multiplying these two numbers. Uh, how I stay organized for this is my M1 and my V1 are my more concentrated. And my M2, V2 are my more dilute. And since I have a smaller volume, this uh, 10 milliliters must be my V1. And my M1 is 0 0.8. My M2 is unknown, and my V2 is 300 milliliters. Uh, mathematically, I can uh, multiply the left-hand side, divide by the right-hand side to get M2 by itself. And I get 0 0.0266666, 0 0.026. And I'm just going to round that to 0 0.0267 molarity sodium chloride solution to three sig figs. Any questions about any of the work I've got here? If not, then let's go ahead and punch it in. Yes, and it does have, uh, so one of the things about uh, these online questions that I'm making is that uh, the system I'm using does not account for sig figs. So uh, you can enter it in with, with your calculator. I prefer to just always have three sig figs uh, and either one will be marked correct.